What's going on guys, Kyger here. In today's video, we have a huge thing you can do to jump ahead with your equipment. Very particular to the NA server, but is also available down the line on the global server. Let's get into it. All right, so the thing we're gonna be doing is very interesting. So they added this several patches ago where you can put three pieces of equipment together and then make one of the same rarity. Well, of the same uh, star and ascension level. For example, we have the new raid tier over here for the Twilight Hero. So if I go to Enhance and Equipment Combination, you will see uh, I put it in the middle and it, as it says down here, five star or higher legendary equipment to obtain new equipment. New equipment will be the same part as the item registered in the center. So I have the uh, bobble and then I could add whatever I want. Uh, it won't let me add weapons for example and it will be a new bobble of six star to awakened now what's important with this is we really want to do that with weapons for example right here because if we take a look in professions blacksmithing there's only a couple that will be uh six star to awakened that will be the new weapon itself it will be twisted marsh it will be the one that we actually want, uh, the seal weapon, the big thing we're doing here is we're, let's say you get the uh, six star one awakened from the shop itself, uh, from the exchange. It's hard to get to two because that's going to require uh, to go from one to two. It's going to require eight of these wings, which are very, very hard to come by. So if you're able to... Uh, get a six to other weapon which uh could be uh for example a really really good one to do would be something like uh the foggy or the white shadow castle which require no wings to get up to six two uh, you can also do this at six three but that requires a lot of these spears and you may as well just do six two till you get the one that you want and then bring it from 6.2 to 6.3, so you reduce the cost of the spears. But you'll be able to, this is something that uh, Global could even do, and that is uh, get a 6.2 uh, Foggy or White Shadow Castle weapon, and then put them together with other stuff until you get uh, the seal weapon which is the one that everyone wants right now saving a lot a lot a lot of wings and what's interesting is once 6-3 gets added it will require two wings which you'll be able to save up enough wings for that as we as you get to the next raid tier so what's interesting is if we look at the attack difference so 1926 to 2063 and then each roll will also be higher what's also interesting is doing this with your uh side equipment is also powerful so if we take a look uh this requires four wings like i said uh other ones don't require wings no wing no wing same thing with a uh, foggy prison and white shadow castle can do the same thing and the gear that a lot of people are wanting is uh, Boiling Waterfall is pretty good for Orbias. Uh, where's it at? Twisted Marsh is not bad if you're, uh, I'd say, Kina, because Kina likes to use their monsters to take uh, all the damage. And then once it gets added, talking to the global players, uh, I like the Twilight Hero, which reduces the damage your summoner takes by 11% uh, for both Cleef and Orbia. But like I said, uh, you can be happy as Orbia going the burst route with the Boiling Waterfall outfit. And then everyone else that isn't trying to go full burst, Twilight Hero would be very, very powerful. Uh, talking about sub-weapons, I believe most people are... Uh, a, an agreement that the foggy prison is the best reduced summoner damage taken uh, I mean summoner attribute damage taken doesn't matter doesn't matter 
monster damage dealt could be uh, powerful if you're going for that uh, cleave style, just kill them. Uh, but I don't think most people would build that. And then monster crit rate effectively does nothing. Let me know if this trick helps you jump the curve. Until next time, guys.